Say Halloween. By the time you're seeing this, it's probably after Halloween, but let's just pretend, okay? This is not my costume from this year, no, no, no. This year, I went a little ham, a lot more ham than I've ever went before. I did some things that I have never attempted. Prosthetics, a bald cap, painting my whole body. The name of you. I am not a professional makeup artist, that goes without saying, but I tried my best at making a sexy Shrek costume. Shrexy, if you will. I love Shrek, I've always loved Shrek. Shrek is love, Shrek is life. So I wanted to make a Shrek costume, but of course I had to put a funny little twist on it and turn it into a classic ho girl costume. But Shrek. <laughs> So that's what we're doing in this video. I filmed the whole process because I thought it'd be hilarious and it did not disappoint. So buckle up, ladies and gentlemen. For this costume, I got green makeup, spirit gum, a bald cap, a wig cap to go under the bald cap, more green paint, even more green paint, and then prosthetics. I do just want to quickly shout out the girl that I got the prosthetics from. This is what her information is. They were amazing. And without them, I would not have been able to make this costume work. So you're incredible. Thank you so much. All right. Let's get into it. Wow. Oh, sweet jumping Jesus, that looks horrible. Okay, I'm probably gonna be drinking some wine while I do this because I'm going to a party straight from here. I thought I was gonna be cold, but I'm actually already warm. So that's great considering I'm painting my entire body green. So we are going to have to start with the bald cap. That's first things first here. The ball cap I have is white, as you can see. There wasn't a whole lot of selection around and I didn't order anything aside from the prosthetics, so. That's on me. <laughs> but where I'm painting over it green, like I'm just hoping it'll not be that big of a shade difference. <sighs> I had to lock my cats out because I have a feeling they're gonna make this really difficult, but they both have incredible FOMO, especially Sailor. And she wants in. Believe it or not, I am in my bedroom right now. I am not just in a black void. And I think that this setup is gonna get ruined if I let the cats in. But I'm not gonna be able to film with that happening, so. I guess they're gonna have to join us. Relax, honey. You're gonna be a good girl? No. Are you gonna be a good girl? Please stop. I hope that's a yes. It's not. So I got a wig cap to go under the bald cap because I have a lot of hair and I don't think I'm gonna be able to like, put it in a bun or anything. And I can put it in a bun. I, th my head will look not like a normal shape. So first things first, putting my hair in this wig cap. I have never done anything like this before. I'm sure I probably stated that in the intro clip, but I have never used prosthetics, like real prosthetics. And I have most definitely never put on a ball cap. This is gonna be really interesting. I don't even know how to go about this. This is also very fresh ink, so it might look a little bit weird on camera. I feel like my head is probably gonna end up being a weird shape anyways because my hair is Damn, very thick, boy. but I'm gonna try and make it look as normal as I possibly can. I also haven't watched any tutorials or anything before doing this. I'm kind of just winging it, and with alcohol at that, probably not a great combo. Oh my god. I almost just knocked over my wine. Perhaps that's a sign to not attempt this incredibly hard task while drinking. Just a thought. Okay, I need, I, I do need to figure out something else to do though, because my hair is just gonna be in a big weird cone shape if I just plop that all on my head. Maybe I can try and do like... Ugh. Plan of attack, plan of attack, plan of attack, plan of attack, plan of attack. Okay, this is off to a great start. Good. Oh my god. Oh, this is really funny. Okay, I do have to pull it up a bit. I have to make sure all the hair is in there. I have no idea what the back looks like. Thumbnail. <laughs> okay, okay. I wonder if like, this needs to come up a lot more. Does that look better for you? Okay. So I do have stuff to like glue this down. And then I've read you can... <laughs> I've read you can use like alcohol with a Q-tip to kind of like blend the edges. I'm just gonna try and put it on my head first and if I need to cut it, I can do that because I've heard you might need to kind of fit it to your head a bit more. I'm also concerned about the sizing of this thing. This does not look very large. I have a, a big head. My dome is not small. Oh no, oh no. Well, the wig cap's gonna have to go back a lot. Oh no, okay. Take two, take two. My head looks huge. 
<laughs> I might even have to like not include my ears fully in the big cap. How is this even like that's that this is the back, right? Like this has this has to be the back. Okay. Take two. Oh, it's gonna be tight. It's gonna be very tight because of my big fucking head. My only concern is like, I don't want to lose hair when I take all of this off. Like, I don't want to end up gluing my hair into this. You know what I mean? I might try and take a couple of safety pins and like safety pin some of this back. I think that'll be helpful. I should've known. I should've known that I was gonna have to order like an extra large wig cap, bald cap, whatever the fuck. <sighs> my goddamn melon head. <laughs> Why do I have a nipple? I mean, I have two, but why do I have a third one? <laughs> Fuck! Ah! What have I gotten myself into? Oh boy. It's gonna like just. Talented, brilliant, incredible, amazing, show stopping, spec. It's gonna like just cover everything that it needs to. I'm really hoping that once I glue it down with this stuff, it'll stay. I'm using spirit gum, which isn't as. Oh my god, I'm going half deaf. <laughs> Is my ear recovery. It's not as good as the stuff that's recommended by the company that I bought the prosthetics off of, Prozade. It's not quite as good as Prozade from what I've read, but again, didn't start getting everything for this until it was a bit too late to order stuff. You stupid. I'm gonna try and put this on my skin, I think, and then stick this on down. I'm gonna have to do it in sections to make sure that it's really stuck on there so that there's no lifting. Because if this thing lifts, I'm gonna be fucked. Oh. So I'm just gonna put a big old dirty thick out. This is stinging my skin. Good, 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 good. Okay, look at that. Would you look at that? It's the start. You wanna put some of this inside here so it'll like stick to the wig cap perhaps? I'm gonna hope that doesn't end up biting me in the ass. Okay, it's really... Oh no, it's sliding, it's sliding. No! Stay. It's just not dry, like it's still tacky, so I need to hold it here until it's like fully dry, I think. And it's pulling up. Great. Just slather this shit on my skin. Just slather it on. I don't even want to know how bad this is for you. My lack of hearing right now? Let me tell you. Okay. Okay. I'm gonna put this on my ears too so that it fully sticks to my ears. No! We have lifting. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Okay. Everything's a disaster. I think if we have some more, like, like not so much of it is tugging, maybe it'll help. So I'm gonna start just doing this side and then I'll have to come back to that side. I'm gonna pull down the back and try and stick that on even though I can't see at all what I'm doing. Because I think if more of it is pulled down and over my skin, it's gonna help. And that is just a complete guess on my part. It's not going well, folks. I honestly have a second one and I'm half debating seeing if it's big enough to go on top of this and maybe cover some more skin because I'm getting really frustrated. Now, when I say that I have a second one, the color is even less accurate to my skin tone. It was the only one I could find originally and I went to go return it today and I was too late for returns. Like they wouldn't accept it even for an exchange. So I still have it. And I'm wondering if maybe I should try and use it. Is that literally ever going to stick down? I cannot put any more of this sticky stuff down here. Like I literally, I, please just stick. Like please. They're asking so nicely. Oh, the joys. Now there's spirit gum remover that came with this. I'm gonna just pour some out of my fingers right now because this feels disgusting. That was insane of me to do. I just poured that on my hands. That was insane behavior. Okay, I'm gonna quickly wash my hands and I'm gonna grab the other bald cap and I'm gonna see if it's a bigger size than this one. I'll be back. Please don't come for me, I'm so sorry. The feeling is gonna be the exact same size because it looks like it's from the same company. Oh. No, it's the same size, isn't it? Maybe I could do like, maybe. Okay. I do, I do. Maybe I can do like, It? I might just try and glue it down because what do I have to lose at this point? I'm 
sure if there's any professionals watching this right now. They're probably just like screaming at me for everything that I'm doing wrong. <laughs> if there's any of you, I'm so sorry. It helps I'm well aware that I'm just like a full idiot, you know? Like I'm, I'm, I know that. That's information that is not lost to me. Oh, and away it goes. I just want this to go well. I just want it to be good, guys. I just want it to be good so bad. So good that it's so bad. Okay, now let's try and do the same thing on this side. Something's happening back there. I don't know what it is, but something is happening back there. I just don't have confidence this is gonna stay like this. But if it did, that'd be fucking amazing. Now I'm just gonna try and put this down on this side. The back of my head is not looking good, and that I know for sure. Oh, and everything is lifting. I can feel everything lifting. Sick. Sick. Can you tell that I'm losing my my religion? <laughs> See the back? I'm sure it looks so good. Oh my god, I'm sure it looks like really, really good. Now, there's not a chance in hell I'm even gonna try and blend these edges. I was initially gonna really try and make this good, but I'm very quickly being humbled and awakened into the reality that is how not great this is going to turn out. <laughs> I might try and blend a little bit of that, the very front piece. I'm just gonna put a little bit of this on here and see what happens. And it does absolutely nothing anyways. Why did I think that was gonna work? I like really thought that was gonna work. I am going to just go around the edges and put some of the spirit gum just straight on the edges so that it will help it stay on. Cause I just really don't have a lot of faith this is gonna stay on. I have a feeling that putting a second layer on top of this stuff over the first one's also maybe not a good idea, but like it might reactivate stuff underneath if you know what I mean. Here's the prosthetics. I have a feeling this is gonna go horrendously. Here's the nose. It's actually amazing. Like this this girl that does this, I'm pretty sure it's a, a girl. She's amazing. Oh my fucking God. I'm gonna poke some breathing holes in the nostrils because I have a feeling that I am gonna need them. So I'm gonna breathe through my mouth all night. A literal mouth breather. I don't wanna fuck it up though, so I have to be careful. Here we go, okay. I have pierced it. I'm swiveling this thing around a little bit. I mean, that didn't really do anything. So I'm gonna try and just like cut out a little tiny bit of the nose. Yeah, no. I can like snip a little tiny piece of it out. It's probably a really bad idea, isn't it? Sounds like a very bad idea, but here I am trying to do it. I'm gonna use these scissors. So that might work better. Oh, okay. Well, that did it. I mean, it's still hard to breathe a bit, but like, it's a lot better than what it just was. I'm gonna try putting this stuff on the prosthetic instead of my skin, because I don't know exactly where it's gonna need to lay. And I'd like to get all the corners down for this one. <laughs> oh my god. This prosthetic is fantastic. This was amazing. Like, props to this person. I, I'm pretty sure I already plugged them, but I'll put their information on screen again. Because this is great. Edges are already like pretty much blended for me, so like... It shouldn't end up looking too crazy. As long as I can get the top of the nose piece down, like it should actually, I think, blend fairly well with the makeup. Oh, this is not a user-friendly tool. Spirit gum, not the prosthetic. This prosthetic's amazing, as mentioned. The spirit gum's fucking stupid. Don't use spirit gum. Listen to the people you buy stuff from on Etsy. Okay, I'm gonna leave that for now. And I think I'm gonna try sticking on the <laughs> the Shrek ears. Now I have to make sure I don't put these on incorrectly. I think that's I think that's right. I wonder if it's gonna have any issues sticking to the latex. I feel like it won't, but you don't know until you know. I'm dying. I feel like I can't move my head too much or this whole thing is just gonna like, meow. <laughs> I've got my picture of Shrek up so that I can see. It's kind of like here. It's kind of like on the side of his head. It's where your ears would be technically. So like, it's like there, but it needs to go like up here. Yeah, that's actually a good spot, I think. Where do I want it? About there, so. I'm just gonna mark the spot with white eyeliner. I'm constantly checking to make sure my phone's not stopped recording because I would be devastated if it just like didn't record anything substantial or quick because this stuff gets tacky like super duper quick. Okay, I feel like that's not like fully ripe. <laughs> We're gonna go with it. That's stuck on, lovely. Now I just have to make sure that I make it somewhat the same on this side. Okay. 
don't think I've ever went this ham for a Halloween costume. I have done some pretty interesting things. I'll pop some pictures on screen while I glue this down. I love Halloween and I love going all out for shit. I'm doing the most. But I don't think I've ever like committed this hard to a costume. <laughs> okay, why is this one not sticking at all? Yeah. Oh God. Let's try this again. I can see the hole where it was before, so we're gonna try it here. Stick down, stick down, stick down, stick down. No, that's probably worse actually. Let's try here. Okay. Okay. I feel like that's actually kind of okay. And I'm gonna do the same thing, which again might be a total mistake, but I'm gonna try and like just stick some of this on the outside as well so that it has extra sticky support. Oh my God, it's entirely lifting in the back. I'm gonna take a little breather now that everything is mainly applied. This is crazy. This looks crazy. I look insane right now. I'm probably gonna upload some of the footage I just took to my drive because that's the only way I can see this actually working. And then we'll be back to paint. Everybody just pray for me that this will stay. See you in a second. It's been like an hour. I did a couple things that I think are kind of ingenious. First of all, I put Tegaderm around the back of my bald cap, around my neck and stuff. Tegaderm is like a medical product that a lot of people use on tattoos now. It's just like a clear bandage that sticks right on your skin and stays pretty well. left over because I recently got tattooed and then I took some lash glue because lash glue is like latex based I'm like 99% sure and just kind of like put it all around the edges like you can see it's really shiny there I put it all around the edges of everything so that hopefully it blends a little better now that I'm putting some color on I also put on these beasts of nails did a terrible job but that's fine I mean I feel like kind of the worse they are the, the better it kind of goes with everything one literally just came off <laughs> It's like 8.30 p.m. I'm already supposed to be there. I mean, no one's gonna be surprised that I'm late. I'm late for everything, but I got a boogie. I gotta get my ass in motion. I gotta get this shit on me. So I'm just hoping that I can film all of this in enough time. I just hope that I have enough room left to film everything that I need to film. She didn't. So let's fucking work. Let's get going. I'm just gonna start with a simple layer of this, the body paint. I feel like this might work the best. It's also gonna suck doing everything with nails, but I figured like, what else was I gonna do in that dead time of like an hour? I drank a glass of wine and I'm like half drunk now too. <laughs> I was watching Halloween Town and drinking wine. I got a bit caught up in it. So I'm a, I'm a little fuzzy in the brain. I have no idea how any of this is gonna work. Oh, well that's not super pigmented. Great. Oh Lordy Lordy. You know what? I'm just gonna go ahead and do that. Oh no. To clean this up tomorrow because I'm sure as shit not doing it later when I'm drunk after a party. I also have to be careful because, like, I don't want to fuck up the prosthetics. <laughs> I don't know if this is gonna dry down at all because, like, how, how could it really, you know? Oh god, I don't have I don't have a lot of storage, Kim. Be quicker, be quicker. Stop laughing at yourself and just get the green on. alive. It's been a really long week and I wasn't even looking forward to doing this like at all. I woke up in a really not great mood and I was like I don't like I don't I don't want to do any of this today. I wish this had fallen on another night because I'm just fucking exhausted from working so much and trying to edit and get out videos to you. Like all that kind of stuff. So it's just kind of like uh this sucks but I'm quickly coming around. This is helping because this is so funny. You can't really see all the seams the way that I was thinking you probably would, you know? Down here, I'm like sweating. I got a Sula, if you know what that is. If you don't, be informed. We've got ourselves a Sula. Sweaty upper lip alert. So the lip is definitely going to lift, but that's just all we can do. Now, I do have a lighter color as well that's like special effects makeup. I mean, I got it at Party City, so I don't know how special effects it actually is, but it claims to be special effects makeup. <laughs> So I'm gonna try to like almost like contour a little bit. I just wanted to get a base layer down. Can't see the backs of the ears and that's stressing me out a little bit. I'm like wiping it all off and this is what's left, so. <laughs> this is the FX makeup. So I'm gonna try and put some of this on. It says it goes well over latex. I'm assuming it's probably gonna dry a lot better than
Okay, so unfortunately I ran out of time before being able to, you know, like fully film an outro in my Shrek, Shrexy costume. But I did get lots of footage of me in the costume. So I'll insert some footage here of what it ended up looking like. I also took a lot of pictures, so I'll also insert those so you can get the full the full gist of what this costume looked like. What are you doing in my swamp? It was a hoot. I got a lot of laughs from it, and that was the full intention. I'm glad it was enjoyed. I certainly had fun putting it on. Well. You saw. I had some fun and I also had a lot of frustration, but overall it was worth it. It was also probably the most satisfying thing ever to take off all of this stuff. I did it halfway through the party because I just got really overwhelmed having so many layers of gunk on my face and the prosthetics and all that kind of stuff. So I just kind of like ripped them off halfway through the party. <laughs> Satisfaction? That shit felt good. That felt real good. Love that. Love that feeling. All right, but that's gonna be this video. I'm sorry that it's a little a little late. I'm sure everyone's probably in the Christmas spirit now, but uh, not me. I'm still riding that Halloween wave, baby. I really hope you enjoyed watching this video, watching me struggle and then kind of pull it together. But let me know, let me know your thoughts. If you enjoyed it, if you think this costume was a success, if you think that I totally fucking failed, be honest, just let me know in the comments down below. And while you're at it, you might as well just go ahead and click that subscribe button too, because why not, you know? What? Just what? Why not? Why not? Not a lot of reasons not to, okay? So just go ahead and click that. Click like at the same time. Support your girl, I appreciate it so very much. But uh, it's gonna be all for me. I hope you enjoy the rest of every day or night or whenever it is that you're watching this. And I really, really hope that I see you in the next one. Bye. What, 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 what are you doing?